Chapter 1. The Boy Who Lived Mr. and Mrs. Dursley of Number 4 Privet Drive were proud to say that they were perfectly normal, thank you very much. I was born with water on the brain. L'année de mes 17 ans, vers la fin de l'hiver, ma mère a décrété que je faisais une dépression. Tout ça parce que je ne sortais quasiment pas de la maison. It was almost December and Jonas was beginning to be frightened. The Flats Road. We spent days along the Wawanash River helping Uncle. Lots of this 36 days before the week before I left my family in Florida and the rest of my minor life to go to boarding school in Alabama. My mother insisted on throwing me a going away party. Chapter 1. In my younger and more vulnerable years, my father gave me some advice that I've been turning over in my mind ever since. The sun did not shine. Ours is essentially a tragic age, so we refuse to take it tragically. Ba-room, 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 ba-rippity, 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 ba-rippity. Good. His dad had the pickup going. XTC was no good for drowning out the morons at the back of the bus. Dorothy lived in the midst of the great Kansas prairies with Uncle Henry, who was a farmer, and Aunt Em, who was the farmer's wife. Once upon a time, there were two kids named George and Harold. In sooth, I know not why I am so sad. It wearies me, you say it wearies you. But how I caught it, found it, or came by it, what stuff tis made of, whereof it is born, I am to learn. And such a want which sadness makes of me, that I have much to do to know myself. When I stepped out into the bright sun from the darkness of the movie house, I had only two things on my mind, Paul Newman and the ride home. At the far end of town, where the grickle grass grows, and the wind smells slow and sour when it blows, and no birds ever sing excepting old crows, is the street of the lifted Lorax. My name is Marlon Bundo, and I am a bunny. Where's Papa going with that axe? said Fern to her mother as they were setting the table for breakfast. Number 16. Yesterday, I remember thinking I was the happiest person in the whole earth, in the whole galaxy, in all of God's creation. Josh and I hated our new house. Chicago, 1931, when gangster bosses ruled the city. <laughs>